Hello, Cancers, and welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So, Cancer, I gotta say, this reading is pretty serious, okay? Um, I got some uh, downloads and messages before I started your reading. I'm saying right now, I don't like this energy, Cancer, but it's honestly, it's got nothing to do with you. You're very protected, but you're, um, the people who have hurt you, gone up against you, um, they're, they're like cursed, okay? Anyway, Cancer, this reading is for the collective, so it may not be for all of you, okay? Just take what resonates, Cancer. Leave the rest behind. You know, don't try to force this one. And thank you so much, everyone, for all of your support, the likes, subscribes, comments, the love. Thank you so much, you guys. I love you right back. All right, so Cancer, yeah, um, what I'm getting here is a group of people. It's a group of people that are literally, it kind of feels like, it sort of feels like they're drowning in quicksand, okay? The more they struggle to get out of messes or out of, their karma the deeper they get okay so they're praying they're praying to god but here's the devil like but wait a minute weren't you wasn't i your number one just a little while ago the devil's like but wait you still owe me something here you were praying to me before and these are the consequences of that so wasn't I your number one? That's what the devil is saying to these people. Like, it's giving me a really eerie feeling here. Um, and they're, they could be getting haunted. They feel very trapped, okay? These are people that are literally terrified. The three words I got before your reading was cursed, branded, and terrified, okay? So I feel like these people cursed themselves, by going up against you and the divine, okay? Um, treating this whole situation like it was one big fat joke. When in all actuality, it's very, 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 very real. Um, the spiritual warfare, them doing spell work, sending you bad juju, it's made them, now they've cursed their future, they've cursed um, their destiny, they've cursed themselves. And these are people who are literally terrified. And no matter, like, if the, the more they struggle to get out of this, the more they sink down. This is, I'm seeing it as quicksand, okay? Um, and I feel like they're doing all this praying, like, please, God, please help us now. But here's the thing. The devil is like, but wait a minute, you prayed to me. But, you know, a day ago you were praying to me and laughing and smiling. Now you're stuck. Now you can't get out, okay? They really feel like this is it. You know what it feels like to me is a, it, it feels like the most terrifying nightmare you could experience, okay? It really does. And I feel like these people are being haunted. I, they're showing me the scene from, I don't know what movie it is. I, I kind of get the feeling it's like Amityville Horror. <laughs> Um, where the walls look like rubber and the, um, the hands are like sticking through the walls. That's the, that's the image that they're showing me. So I feel like they are completely stuck, completely trapped, um, going through some kind of nightmare in their life. Like it's, it's terrifying for these people. I, I feel like they're getting, um, like poltergeist activity and being touched and, um, hearing growling sounds in their house like for real these are all the things that I'm picking up on guys um, meanwhile cancer you're free from this I feel like you're living a life of peace you prayed to the right one cancer right you prayed to your father God not to the devil there's a big difference in energy here and the people that were sending you bad energy laughing about it like I said, thinking there would be no consequence, they have now kind of sealed their doom. For real, that's really what it feels like. And the more they struggle to get out, the more they drown and, um, and get stuck in quicksand. Okay, that's really the feeling that I'm getting. Yeah, all the lies, deceit, betrayal, on um, this uh, high priestess energy, playing, watching you, sending you bad juju, um, yeah, they don't, this is coming out in reverse. It's, it's like sinking in quicksand. Okay. 
So, um, yeah, honestly, you guys, I feel like everything is going wrong in their life, okay? And it's, it's all kind of hitting them all at the same time. And this is an entire group of people. Um, like maybe six people. It could be a friend group. It could be a family group. I feel like these people spread lies about you. Um, they, they tried to maybe steal something from you, steal your energy, take your ideas, try to copy you, and thought they could get away with it. Look at the, as they're laughing here. They're not laughing anymore. And the divine, or um, the devil here is reminding them who, who they were praying to then. Now they're stuck in this. These people just curse themselves. Um... All right, what else can you show me here? Honestly, you guys, I'm going to have to clear this energy out. I don't know how long I'm going to I'm going to have this reading on the table here. Yeah, now these people are kind of scrambling, okay? They're grouping together cancer, um trying to figure out a plan to get back in, make things solid, give you an apology. They're trying to avoid their any more karma. And it's not going to happen. They, the devil has branded them. They've been branded by the devil. They're absolutely terrified. And um, they're cursed. You know, I feel like they had a chance to pray to the right God here. They had a chance to go to God. But they didn't. Okay, they refused. They refused the spiritual lesson. They refused praying to God. They refused to believe. They, re they just kept doing what they were doing. You know, I'm seeing people dancing around, chanting maybe, lies, trying to stay, steal your energy, trying to take your abundance away, you know, whatever they were doing, right? And the devil's like, uh, no, nope, you're mine now. These people curse themselves. They were all up in their ego, thought they could control the situation. This is also, I can see this as an abuse of power. Okay. Um, there could have been, you know, I want to say it's witchy poo stuff. Okay. I really do. They could have been doing some witchcraft here. Um, definitely spell work. Uh, not that I'm seeing any spell work cards, but I'm feeling it up here. Okay. And I feel like your energy was too strong. And these people with the, I just saw, yep, look, everything's coming back on them. I just saw the Four of Cups. They didn't want to stop doing it. They didn't want to stop doing what they were doing. They treated it like it was a joke. They thought they'd play around with spell work. They thought they would do some chanting to the devil. They thought that they could maybe summon up a demon or two. I don't know what these people were doing. All I know is that now they're praying, but the devil's already got them branded. Okay, does that make sense? And that means these people are cursed. I feel like everything they did, cancer or sent out to you now, is coming right back on them. And these people are terrified. They don't know how to make this stop. Um, they're, they're thinking a, a simple apology is going to do it, but it's not. And with strength coming out here, I'm getting the sense that whatever these people did, dancing around, chanting, doing their witchy poo stuff, whatever it was, it, was it, it ended up being pretty strong, but it's ending up going back on them, okay? Because you're out here being protected. I feel like you're protected by the divine, okay, Cancer? Because you prayed to the Father God. You asked for help. You didn't send it. Yep, see, you're a spiritual being, right? You were, you were of the light, Cancer. You were of the light. In this cup, it's more than love. It's your spirituality. It's, it's your faith, everything you feel deeply at a soul level, everything you believe in at a soul level, um, your intuition, your um, spiritual abilities, your psychic abilities, the messages you get from the divine, you believed. You believed and you were of the light, Cancer, and because of that, you're being freed from this toxic situation. You're being um, free and absolved of any kind of negative energy, okay? Um, it's, it can't work on you anymore. You're in the light. 
these people though they're they're branded and harnessed now to the devil okay and it's a whole group of them and these are people that sent you nothing but hate see they wanted to see you in the ten of swords energy feeling betrayed defeated um backstabbed hurt in a lot of pain and they did they did they sent you bad energy i want to say they sent you bad energy because i don't know what they did i don't know anything about witchy poo stuff or spell work you guys you know i don't know about that stuff but i know they sent you a lot and it's all coming back on them it can't touch you so it's got to go somewhere and it's all coming back on them and they're stuck now with the devil whatever spell work they did to you it has to run its course so it's going to be running its course on them and the more they did the the more they sink in that quicksand right that you know and the harder they struggle to get out the farther in they get okay yeah some of these people could be getting some um illnesses right losing money everything that they touch is is just wrecked or it doesn't work out you know they it's almost like a hopeless situation it's giving me this feeling of there's just no hope okay there's no hope and you guys know when i say um you know hopelessness and despair are the heaviest energies of all because there's no light there's no light energy. It's all very dark. It's all very heavy. You're the one who's in the light, Cancer. Queen of Cups, the sun, with this, with this uh, dove, okay? And I feel like, yeah, this is justice. These people are getting their karma. Look at the chaos. They're getting their karma, okay? And I feel like the divine has forsaken them. They've left them behind. You know, I, I really am sensing that. They walked away from God and they kept doing what they were doing. They kept sending bad energy no matter how many warnings they got. They kept sending it. So the divine's like, you're branded by the devil now. This is your karma. Now you must suffer the karma of your own spell work your own negativity, your own hate. It's all coming back on you all at once. The whole group, the whole group, they could be fighting amongst themselves. These people, they once grouped up against you, right? They teamed up against you, worked together as a group against you, Cancer. Well, now they're having to fight each other in this group. It's all coming back on them. They're having sleepless nights, nightmares, right? It's all because of, the, because of the sabotage, because of the backstabbing, the betrayal, the lies, the way they sent you bad energy and laughed at it. These people are being shown in their dreams. They can't get out of their head. Some of these people are being driven insane. Okay, for real. Some of them are being driven insane. And they, it's, it's like a living nightmare. It really is. It's like a living nightmare, and they feel absolutely stuck. It kind of feels like, um, it kind of feels like being in a really freaky horror movie. That's, that's the feeling I'm getting off of it, okay? And no matter how they try to get out, um, they can't. They keep getting deeper and deeper in. I'm kind of getting the sense that they made some kind of sacrifice here, too. They did a lot here, Cancer. They did a lot. Okay? They did a lot. They put, they did a lot of work here against an empress. And then they sat back and waited and watched you with a smile on their face, um, waited for it to all work and take, an, take effect. And now it's coming back on them. It had no effect on you. It's seriously like one of those suspense thriller horror movies where these people are like 
stuck in a weird, uh, I don't know, in a weird, like, surreal kind of ghost story or something, and they can't seem to break out. It really is a living nightmare. Yeah, none of it had any effect, Cancer. This is the, this is the spell work they sent you. Okay, but when it got to you, it made you more powerful in a positive way. It seemed to, um, it seemed to kind of help propel you forward. It sort of made you more abundant. I feel like it was transmuted and transformed for you. And what didn't reach you, now it's coming back on them. All of the negative parts of it are coming back on them. Okay. It did not have any effect on you, Cancer. You're still very abundant. Your business is going to keep growing as long as you keep nurturing it, right? Your abundance is going to keep growing as long as you keep putting in the effort. Okay, focusing on you. That's what you did. You focused on yourself. You got the messages from the divine and you listened. And you were thankful and you work together with the divine to create all that you've created, okay? I feel like Cancer, you're in the clear. You are, and you're free from all of this. And you're, you're, it's almost like you're being protected and freed so that you don't get any of this karma, right? Oh, but these people, they are so screwed. They are stuck with the devil. The devil's got them in chains, branding them. Look at, they're being branded. What did I say? They're being branded by the devil. These people are terrified, sinking further and further into their own karma, and they can't seem to, to get out. Um, they're trapped in a living nightmare every day, losing money, getting health issues, going insane. I kid you not, these people are going insane. Look at them, fighting amongst themselves, putting the blame on, on each other. Um, meanwhile, Cancer, you in star energy, light worker energy, living a life of peace, right? Praying to the divine, being a messenger here, an empath, a healer, the divine is taking you to calmer waters they're getting you away from these people. So some of you could be feeling like you have to go on a, like make a house move or go on a, on a vacation or something to get away. Like all of a sudden it pops in your mouth. Oh, I guess I have to move. You know what I mean? That's the divine giving you the messages. It's time to get you out of, out of that environment, away from these people, as far away from the devil as, as possible. You're being protected here, Cancer, while these people are stuck in a living nightmare that's driving them insane. Okay? It is. Yep. And you're protected because of your loving, healing energy and the way you um, listened to the divine and you were obedient. So God's got you. God's protecting the ones who are faithful and loyal to God. And you know what? The devil's got the ones who are praying to the devil. They're branded now. They're marked. Okay? Some of them could even be getting some kind of mark um, on their face, their forehead, their hands. I've picked up on that before. Um... Yeah, all of the divine beings here are protected. So these are most likely karmic individuals. And if your person, if this is a twin flame, if this is your divine masculine or feminine, and they were doing the spell work against you, guess what? They're branded too. They're branded too. And now they're sinking. Yeah, judgment. Look at, ooh, some of these people will pay the ultimate price. I've got the death card. Depending on what they sent to you, Cancer, it's coming back on them. If they sent any kind of spells to unalive you, guess what's going to happen to them? You know, this is divine judgment. This is judgment, karma. Look at this. 
We've got we've got karma here for choosing the devil. There's the devil card. We've got the devil out here twice. We've got uh, judgment, justice, the higher font, and you being protected here by the divine. These people will, were manipulators, and I feel like they abused their power. This is also spell work here with a magician coming out with the devil and death. I'm telling you, Cancer, man, these people are, are trapped now. It's, it's literally, they're giving me images of so many different horror movies, you guys. <laughs> but, like, I don't want to also put that energy out there. Like, I don't like doing readings like this because I don't like this energy at my table. But um, but I'm, I'm getting so many visions of really weird horror movies, okay? And that's the kind of stuff that these people are stuck in. This spiritual warfare is very real. I, I feel like these people have opened a Pandora's box here, okay? That we've got the devil out here twice. One of them could be a demon, okay? We've got the death card. We've got um, the nine of swords here, justice, judgment. Oh, my gosh, man. On an earth angel, That's this is why. They were messing with the wrong person here. These people curse themselves because of how they messed with you. Okay, you don't touch an earth angel. You don't try to harm an earth angel. You don't try to do spell work on an earth angel. You don't. You're very protected out here, Cancer. Um, and these people, they're living a nightmare. All right, so what else can you show me? So they're, they could be getting sick. They could be... Um, some of them could be getting into like accidents here, okay? Uh, they're, they're having insomnia, they're having nightmares every single night. They're fighting and blaming each other. There's a lot of chaos, a lot of drama, a lot of suffering, a whole lot of suffering, okay? And yeah, completely off balance, feeling like they're sinking in quicksand. That's the feeling that I'm getting here, Cancer. Um, all because of the offers that they made to the devil. To the devil. Yeah, and it's all it's multiple people. So it's a whole entire group that went against an earth angel here. And all the illusions are down here, Cancer. Okay. Yeah, you could be dealing with a, a fire sign, too. There could be a fire sign in this. I've got Virgo, Aries, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Libra, Scorpio, um, Aquarius. You know, I feel like um, they thought they would have a victory in this. They're mad because they didn't, okay? There's uh, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, maybe, who is doing some kind of spell work on you. Or, no, I feel like this was somebody who was paying for it to be done. Paying for it. And then they kind of waited around to see if it was going to take effect. A lot, of a lot of work was done here, Cancer. They did a lot of work. And it's all coming back on them. And the devil's just like, I got you now. You know, I got you. Yeah, they cannot move forward here. Chariot in reverse. Um, not having any kind of victory. Unable to heal from anything. It's a constant battle that they're stuck in. Okay, no forward movement. They could be getting into some kind of car accident or maybe some, like, problems with their car. I keep picking up on a car accident or car issues, okay? I mean, they can't even go anywhere. They're, some, of them, some of these people are stuck um, in their home that's got demons in it now, okay? They're being haunted. Yeah, stuck. Look, this, some of them are stuck in their home, being haunted, being haunted, okay? This is haunted too. 
completely stuck because of the work they put in, because of the spell work they did, because they had to pay to do it or have it done. Sorry, they had to pay to have it done. And meanwhile, I, you know what? They did it to a spiritual being. They did spell work on a spiritual being and everything, their whole entire foundation, their homes are being haunted, destroyed. Some of these places could be catching on fire. I'm seeing fires. Um, I'm seeing major cataclysms here, really, okay, um, for these people. Yeah, high priestess energy. If they hired anyone to do the spell work on you, Cancer, the high priestess is going down. Anybody that touched this, anybody that went up against an earth angel, it's over for these people. They're branded, and now the, de the devil's got them. Okay? They're branded and cursed. This is spell work. This is a high priestess, and this is the high priestess going down. I'm telling you, Cancer. All right. Give me one more here. They could have done some moon magic recently. I feel like they did a lot of things. I feel like they sent you a lot of spell work. Okay. But none of it had any negative effect. Yeah, now these people are ashamed. Now they're in regret. But there's nothing they can do now. They've been branded. Okay. They've been branded. The devil's got them. They're chained to the devil now. There's nothing they can do. And, and if, this is, if they hired somebody to do it, this high priestess is in regret because their life is getting completely demolished as well. Anybody who, did, who tried to send any bad energy or tried to harm an earth angel, they're going down. Guaranteed. Some of them are getting STDs. They're getting health issues. They're getting stuck in life. They've cursed their destiny and their future by messing with you, okay? Um, let me get your advice in this. And then, you guys, you know what? Normally, I would do an extended, but I really just want to get rid of this energy. I'm sorry, but yeah. Um, I, don't, I don't really feel like we need to look further into this, okay? What is Cancer's advice for this? Cancer's advice. I feel like, Cancer, you're already following the divine. You're already um, it, putting your trust in the divine, and the divine is protecting you, okay? Yeah, sleep. See, the difference is who's sleeping at night, right? I feel like Cancer and whoever has been praying to God is sleeping like a baby. And whoever has been praying to the devil and casting spell work is having a really hard time sleeping because they can't get past the nightmares. They, they wake up throwing up. I'm seeing somebody waking up and literally projectile throwing up everywhere. Okay. Um... So they're getting sick. Somebody could be getting really sick. Fevers. I'm seeing them breaking out in like, I want to say it's it looks like mumps or something. Chicken pox, but bigger. It looks like mumps or something like that. I don't, they're, man, weird stuff is happening to these people, you guys. It really is kind of like scenes from horror movies here. All right. Um, what else can you show me? So, Cancer, you're sleeping at night. You're probably just, you know, getting your beauty sleep and um, having beautiful dreams. You know, these people, though, oh, Cancer, it's terrible. Um, yeah, exchanging gifts. Cancer, you and the Divine have been working together this whole time. Look at this. You've been working together this whole time. I feel like you're being blessed, Cancer. You're about to be happy, happy. 
And um, yeah, I feel like you're going the distance. You've made it, Cancer. You're, 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 you've learned your lessons. You've passed your tests. You made it through judgment, and you get to go. You get to go. You get to keep moving forward, and you are getting congratulated and blessed here, held in high regard by the divine. On the bottom of the deck, again, is justice. We've got the devil card out here twice. We've got justice out here twice. So I feel like everyone is getting exactly what they deserve for the energy that they put out there, right? You've put out positive energy, Cancer. You've, you've paid attention to your own business and you've listened to the divine. So you're about to be blessed in major ways, big ways, okay? But these people, what they've done has them stuck with the devil, branded and cursed, okay? I'm telling you, that's the balancing of the scales. You know, you've put in positive work, but they've put in spell work. And I feel like now the divine, once again, this is leading you to calmer waters, right? This is the divine getting you out of there. Um, maybe a house move or a vacation. I feel like you've, you've done your spiritual cleansings. You've had the divine right here with you, smiling upon you this whole time. Um, yeah, so you are in receiving mode and you know that your blessings are coming in, Cancer. And this is a whole community here who did this to you, wanting to keep you stuck. And you can't keep a light worker stuck. I'm talking to a light worker out here. And the divine needs you to be doing your job, to be a healer, um, somebody who inspires other people, who has to have positive vibes. They're not allowed to keep sending you relentless spell work, okay? It had to come to an end, and it's coming to an end now. You're no longer having to worry about the spell work anymore. I feel like you have divine protection. You made it through. And these people, they're now the devil's toys. They are. They're just little toys now for the devil. Okay? Wow, Cancer. I'm going to clear this energy off of my table, you guys. All right? Um, but, yeah, I, I hope this helps. And um, if you like this video, please hit that like button. Subscribe to my channel if you like this vibe, right? Um, and um, until next time, Cancer, take care of you and peace out.